What is going on guys, Jinji here for you guys is a Black Ops 3 leaked weapons info video. So for today's video, I'm just going to be telling you guys and also in the link down below in the description, I will just have a link straight to what I'm kind of reading off of. So this is leaked info about the guns and um, before I get started I just want to say yeah I'm playing GTA 5 but it's just background gameplay so it doesn't really matter but uh, <laughs> now back to the video. Uh, this is leaked, so if you guys do not know what leaked means, it just means that it's someone that has kind of been snooping around the files, or it, may, it might even be a hoax, some kind of stupid joke, but I really doubt it is, because it comes from a pretty decently reliable source, honestly. It's not like, just like some random website, it's actually like a Call of Duty Intel website, so all the info about stuff, so, um, so it's pretty reliable, so... It might be somewhat right, might be somewhat wrong, it might be totally wrong, might be 100% right, I'm at, I guess we'll find out. But it's just leaked guns that are going to be in Black Ops 3. So, everybody's waiting for this game, hopefully it does not have exosuits, this is my opinion, I guess. But, now for the guns, alright, we got about 6 assault rifles, seems like... What this looks like to me is just that they took the best guns from every Call of Duty and put them in, black, and put them in one COD. So, that's pretty sweet, honestly, like... I'm just going to be reading off the guns for you guys. The assault rifles, obviously the gun that's been in almost all the CODs for the past like three or four years now. The AK-12, um, also in Battlefield, I mean, you got to have at least some kind of AK in there. AK-47, AK, I mean, AN-94, I mean, they're all kind of the same thing. But we got the AK-12, the gun, oh man, the gun of MW3, the ACR, uh, the SCAR-L, you got to have one of them boys. Oh man, SCARs are my stuff. The CM-901. I'm pretty sure that was in MW3 too. I, I haven't really, I didn't really play MW3 that much, but I'm pretty sure that was in the game. Um, then we got the Call of Duty Ghost Gun, the Honey Badger. That's going to be pretty sweet. And I've never heard of this one before, but it's called the HK416. Um, so if you guys have heard that before, I guess you guys can kind of tell me what it is like down in the comments below. Uh, now for the submachine guns, we have the Scar PDW, which is new. Um, the PDW, well, maybe not new. PDW has been transferred from a submachine gun to a pistol, and then they're going to have the SCAR PDW, so maybe it's like a PDW with upgraded range type of thing. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Um, of course, we have the MP7, the MSMC, which is pretty cool. I'm glad to see that coming back. That gun was pretty swag. Uh, we got the Bison. Um, that was from Ghost, I think. Yeah, it was kind of a faster shooting, uh, small range gun. Not too bad. The UMP. Pretty sure that was from MW3, and that was actually a decent one. I think it's like the MP5K, if I'm not mistaken. The PDR, never heard of that one before. And we have the Mac 11, so if you guys, that's from Black Ops 1, I'm pretty sure. Black Ops 1, it's just like a very, very, it's practically like an Uzi, but a little bit smaller. So, that's it for there. Now for the shotguns, to start us off, we got the worst shotgun in COD history, the KSG. Uh, we got the RAS, or RAS-12. I'm just guessing that's kind of, kind of like the Spaz, RAS, whatever. The UTS-15, the Origin-12, the... I think it's called the Sa Saga. Might be, I might be saying it wrong, might, may, I don't know. But the Saga-12 and the 612 or the SIX-12. So we got a lot of 12s in there. We got a 15, and then we just got a straight-up KSG. I've never heard of any of those before except the KSG, so I guess that'll be new shotguns. That, that would be pretty sweet to see. Now for the LMGs, I am really glad, I actually really like these LMGs, I would be glad if they brought the LSAT back for all your L LSAT lovers, they did not bring that back, well at least in the leaked info anyways, but what they have here, we got the Hammer, which was from Black Ops 2, it was kind of a faster shooting, a little bit smaller ammo capacity LMG, pretty strong and pretty beast, then we got the MK46, I'm just guessing it's just like, kind of like a bigger, I don't know, <laughs> but uh, Next, we have from the Black Ops 1, we got the RPK-12. Hopefully it's the same way, because I know that gun was really sweet. Mostly for zombies, that gun was pretty go pretty godly. Uh, next, we have uh, probably my favorite of all the LMGs, uh, the M27 IAR from Call of Duty Ghost. That thing was a complete boss. That was like the LSAT from Black Ops 2, but in a ghost game. That thing is just a god. And uh, the Shrike, or the Shriek, however you pronounce that, I guess. 
Um, so that's a new one too. Next for the marksman rifles slash heavy weapons, uh, we got of course the MK14 that's in like every COD, the SA58, the Buzzard, and the G28. So I've never really heard of any of them except the MK, so I guess that would be kind of new to us. And now for the sniper rifles, I'm kind of surprised they, bought the, they brought this one back instead of the DSR, but they've got the Ballista, the M408, the XLR, the M98B. So we got four snipers, uh, not bad, not bad. Now for the pistols, I'm, oh man, I love this one, I remember this one, the G18, um, that's pretty much like the Cat 40, but a little, oh, well, God, way better, in my opinion, anyway. We got the TAC-15, um, I would guess, in my opinion, I would say that the TAC-15 is like the Executioner, if you guys don't know, the Executioner was a shotgun, <laughs> a shotgun built into a little pistol, but I'm just saying that just because, I mean, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is the TAC-12, which is a shotgun, so... They just added three numbers to it, made it a 15. Um, I would guess it's something like that. Then we have the SW500 and the M93. So I'm guessing those are just kind of regular pistols. So go like a, a machine pistol, then a um, some kind of like shotgun pistol, and then two just regular pistols. Um, so those that's the whole entire um, guns list that has been leaked for Black Ops 3. So that would be pretty sweet if this was correct because... Then we always know what we've been hoping for. And so far, it looks like that the submachine guns will be pretty nice. But the assault rifles are going to be godly. Like, that's just going to be insane to see them all those guns in the same Call of Duty. And then the shotguns, we're going to be very, very surprised on those. Those are all new except the one of them. So, uh, yeah. Any guns I didn't really say nothing about because I don't know about. If you guys can tell me what COD they were in and stuff like that, I would look them up and uh, kind of see what they're all about. Um, so that's it for today's video guys also like I said in the beginning in the description if you guys are going to want to go see the list by yourself link to the description down below and uh, yeah go check that out also check all the other links for if you guys want to join my GTA 5 crew or uh, buy some gaming gum use my code to get 5% off anything like that check me out and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching if you guys have enjoyed leave a like and subscribe for more daily GTA 5 glitches and soon to be coming Black Ops 3 info so thank you guys for watching I'll see you in the next one Peace out.